Hi guys, good evening. I'm Mitchell Alforque, a past pupil of then Don Bosco Technical High School in Labangon, Cebu City. Notice my background? That's our chapel. And it's the same building for the past 40 years and so. I am happily married for 22 years. Now for my good night talk. Recently, I came across a YouTube video that shows 16 local celebrities who kept their virginity until marriage. Among those familiar to me are actress Tony Gonzaga, TV host Nikki Hill, Miss World Philippines Megan Young, singer Sarah Geronimo, actor Robbie Domingo, and a former PBA player turned TV host, Chris Chu. Except for Robbie, all that I mentioned are now married. Let me share to you two notable quotes that shows being chaste requires strong values and form conscience. From Megan Young, she says, sex is for marriage. That's my belief. You say no. If the guy is willing to sacrifice, that means a lot. From Chris Chu, very profound words. To me, chastity is a manifestation of true love. Love involves waiting and sacrificing. And that would make your relationship and your marriage even more special. Aren't their words encouraging? Indeed, yes. It is refreshing to see these young celebrities going against the worldly vices of show business, where sex is being promoted and sold in all media platforms. These young celebrities are the true light in an industry where values and morals are relative. Chastity, or holy purity as some saints wants to call it, and I love to call it the same, holy purity is a moral virtue, a gift from God, a grace, and a fruit of the Holy Spirit. It involves continuous practice and self-mastery as an expression of human freedom directed towards self-giving. It will always be a lifetime struggle for us, regardless of one's vocation, whether one is single, married, or committed to a consecrated life. Let me share some consideration for you to practice holy purity. You can ponder on this when you go to sleep later. First, guard our senses. This includes avoiding the occasion of sin. For the young, prefer going out on group dates. For those married, avoid, if possible, going out with opposite sex. Bring your spouse along with you. And for the clergy and those in consecrated life, take good care of community life. Second, sincerity. Talk about your struggles to your spiritual advisor and confessor. God uses them to keep you chaste. Third, proper decorum and modesty. A saint once said, decorum and modesty are younger brothers of purity. Let us dress properly and think about others. Let us ask ourselves, will my attire lead others to sin? And lastly, regular prayers and sacraments, frequent Holy Communion, frequent confession, daily prayers, Devotion to our Mother Mary through the Rosary are effective practices 
used by saints to live holy purity. Remember, these are the same advices Don Bosco and Saint Dominic Savio has taught us. And I remember the homily of Father Mel Graceles in his online mass yesterday. Holiness runs in our Salesian family, and it is only possible if we are in communion with Jesus 24-7. Friends, holy purity is essential to enter heaven. In closing, let us ask the help of our Mother Mary, help of Christians, and Saint Joseph, her most chaste spouse, to intercede for us, keep our mind untainted, our heart pure, our body chaste, and to help us serve Jesus in perfect chastity. Thank you and good night. Bye.